want you to pray, you know, in Genesis 26, the Bible says that Isaac sowed in the land, and in that same year, he reaped a hundredfold. September is coming to an end, which means the third quarter is coming to an end. 
and we will get into the last lap of 2022. There are things you want to accomplish in 2022, it looks like you have not accomplished them. Some you have accomplished, and if you have accomplished, you can still accomplish more. I want you to go before God this morning and say, Father, say, Father, help me reap and eat the good of this land. In the name of Jesus, in this 2022, Lord, let my effort, Lord, reap and let me eat and enjoy the good of this land. In the mighty name of Jesus, just turn that into your prayers. Just turn that into your prayers. Father, Lord, let me eat, O oh Lord. Let me reap, O oh Lord. Let me enjoy, O oh Lord, the good of this land. In the mighty name of Jesus, In the mighty name of Jesus, Oh Lord, help me. Father, help me. King of glory, help me. Patient of days, help us, O Lord, that we will reap, O Lord, that we will eat, O Lord, the good of this land. In the mighty name of Jesus, my God and my King, send your help, O Lord. Send your help, O Lord. Send your help, O Lord. Rende sonde yekete kariba sandaya. Rende sanda yekete koriba sandaya. Imbrande sanda yekete koriba sandaya. Father, we say thank you. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. In Jesus' name we have prayed. You say, Father, say, Father, in this land, I will not labor in vain. In the name of Jesus, turn that into your prayers and say, Lord, in this land, I will not labor in vain. I will not labor into licking pockets. In the name of Jesus, Father, Lord, send your help, O oh Lord, to your children. None of us will labor in vain. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, we will not labor in vain. We will not labor for waste. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, Lord, send your help to your children. Lord, that we will not labor in vain, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus, thank you, Father in heaven. Ancient of those who praise you. In Jesus' name we have prayed. In Jesus' name we have prayed. We pray from Proverbs 12. Proverbs chapter 12, verse 27. Verse 27. It says, it says, can we have it on the screen? The slothful man roasted not that which he took in hunting, but the substance of a diligent man is precious. The substance of a diligent man is what? is precious and you know that precious things attract more value does that make sense so once you are diligent your output will be precious does that follow because the bible won't lie so we will raise our hands to god and ask god for that spirit of diligence you will say father help me be diligent in all that i do at work at school whatever it is that you do just say father give me that spirit of diligence in the name of jesus help us be diligent oh lord in the mighty name of jesus Father, Lord, help us be diligent, O oh Lord. Help us be diligent, O oh Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus, O oh Lord, help us be diligent. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father in heaven, send your help. Send your help, O oh Lord, that the works of our hands will be precious. In the name of Jesus, King of glory, send help to your children. Lord, that we will be diligent. In all that we will do, we will not be slack, O oh Lord. We will not be slothful, O oh Lord. In the name of Jesus, turn that into your prayers and say, Lord, as I go about my daily business, help me, Lord, that I will not be slack. I will not be slack in any way. 
Thank you, our Father in heaven. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Brethren, it's possible for all of us to come to church like this today. And when you come, some people benefit more than, more than some. Praise the Lord. Some people benefit more than some. Can we look at Hebrews chapter 4, verse 2? Hebrews 4, verse 2. And I want us to read it together before we pray. Hebrews 4, verse 2. Let's go. For unto us was the gospel preached as well as unto them. But the word preached did not profit them, not being mixed with faith in them that heard it. So it's possible for people to come to church like on a day like today and the word will not profit them. The church will not profit them. They have just left their house for a regular routine. But you have been here today and I trust God that your presence here will not be a waste. In the name of Jesus, you will pray to God this morning and say, Father, say, Father, say, Father, help me, O Lord, that the word that will be preached today will profit me. In the name of Jesus, Masin de Yekete Koriba Sandaya, Rondo Sin de Yekete Koriba Sandaya, Randa Sanda Yekete Kariba Sandaya. Say, Father, Lord, let the words that will be preached today profit me, O Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus, Rondo Sin de Yekete Koriba Sandaya. Father, Lord, let the word that will be preached today. Let it profit us. Let it profit us. In the mighty name of Jesus, Masende Yekete Koriba Sandaya. Rende Sende Yekete Koriba Sanda. Lord, let the word profit. Let the word profit. Let the word profit. In the mighty name of Jesus, Abba Father, we say thank you. We give you all the praise, O Lord. In Jesus' name we have prayed. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Father, we say thank you for another day like this. Thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness, for your mercies, for your kindness, for your compassion. Lord, as we go on with the service, we ask, Lord, that indeed you will bless us, you will help us, that you will sustain us and continue to keep us in perfect peace. In Jesus' name we have prayed.